before starting this video i just wanna say if you want to support this channel make sure to check the description the link to my website of all my cc's anything i use will be in there and you can also refer to my gpay link so yeah that's all thank you guys for supporting this channel it's been a crazy journey and we have made it this far and we ain't stopping till 100k so let's go so let's begin the tutorial first we just make a comp these are my comp settings as you can see 1080x 1440 that's like my base for every edit i use which i usually upload in instagram it can also be 1920x uh, 1080 like this 1080 so any format you want so make a composition i will keep it 1440 just for this while and put your frame rates here and click ok so make this composition so after we are done we will make the first type of outro so first after creating this comp we will make a text layer and here you can write your name like i will write flexi here ok so here is the first thing then you can click align then click on this and click on this so the video becomes in well let me just bring this here so you all can see it generally i keep it outside but yeah so yeah you're done here after you make this then you can add start adding the effects before doing that we can also make the effect like this so you click on this stopwatch for both position and scale so as long as you want the video the duration you have for it i usually keep it like uh, 35 seconds or something like that so let it play sorry 35 frames or something like that so yeah like this around this strength then here as you go we're gonna zoom it out like this and here make it a bit bigger align and make it to the center go to the next frame see it's uh, gone a bit down so we'll make it again to the center so yeah after you're done just easy ease the frames and turn on motion blur so yeah you're done as you can see it looks smooth you are done with that effect then we will start applying the main effects so after it comes up then we will add deep glow to it deep glow so after we are done adding deep glow we will keep these settings these are my usual settings which i use so keep it around the radius to 650 or 600 then we will keep the exposure to 1 itself we will make no changes to it then we will make the threshold 100 or 5 yeah something like that 100 and make this 102 so after you're done also don't forget to cl click the unmelt option this one required for text okay so it makes the thing transparent or else this will be a black layer something like that so let me show you make a solid layer how it will look without it so it looks like this so if you use this it becomes transparent so yeah let's go we are done with that and then we will make this spread to like 20 to 25 or uh, yeah 20 looks good enough then we will start adding our shadows yeah so here we will keep it just normal 55 i like to keep it that way and then we will add ace drop shadow so this is the main shadow here which we will be using keep it like 0 0.9 then we will make this one to like shadow blur 110 something like that 110 150 and then we'll make it to the center then we'll start adding the signal effect as you can see it looks good already so then we will add signal to it and then we will open the luma modulation and then we will click on frequency and make it 0 0.7 then go like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, maybe 10 frames here. Yeah? Then make it 2.5 and then we will like go a bit far like here yeah? where the 
this thing ends like something like this and make it 0.7 again so after we are done it will look like this so as it zooms up yeah as you can see it looks like this so to make it look more better we will easy ease these frames the three of this easy ease them then go to these first frames zoom in and make the graph like like this this to here yeah. we are done we don't need to do anything else to it basically it will look fine just like this I'll make it quarter so that you can get a clear image of it so it will zoom out like this if you want you can make it according to yourself if you want less zoom you want more zoom that's upon you so yeah that's how it looks so let's move on to the second one so for the last outro type we will keep the same settings as usual as you can see nothing has changed i just removed the signal effect from it. so here is the overlay which i will provide you in the description link so make sure to download it first so yeah then we will add it to the com as you can see it's like a glitch overlay okay then we'll make this to blending mode to lighten or screen anything you like i usually keep lighten so it looks a bit better yeah but as you can see it's a bit slow for it so we will make the zoom a bit closer so you can see we will keep it like this yeah then we are done so as you can see we are already done with this video so thank you guys for watching and any mobile users watching this i want to just say add the video to your comp or anything which your app says like add it to your comp and then make the blending mode to overlay and just zoom in your text or zoom in zoom out anything you like according to yourself it's the same thing you just needed the overlay and text glow you can also add that you can add text glow and zoom it out a bit as you like and make sure to subscribe so yeah that's it signing out